right? We'll do that again. Twenty one to twenty one to twenty two fifty. Twenty one twenty two fifty. So that's about a hundred and fifty health approximately with that. Now without Mikhail's without the twenty percent heal power, put a thornmail in there, so we don't have the additional heal power anymore. Let's let's uh let's take our health down a bit. Once again. We'll we'll do it a bit more. We're at 1750 up to 1880. 1750 up to 1880. 1750 to 1880 is about fucking 130. So, 20% healing power. Can I disable health regen? Is that a thing I can do? No. I cannot. That's a shame. 23. Yeah. So, without Mikhail's Crucible, it's about 20 less healing. But keep in mind, this is also wished with this. And, you know, these trading dummies have 100 armor. So what what about what about the later cues? How much do they heal? That healed for about as much as the first one, I think. Twenty one seventy. Twenty one seventy. Twenty-three eighty, I think. So that is two, three, two, one, two, one. Healing power, no healing power. This is still no healing power. Okay, okay. We gotta check Q3 with healing power now. So get rid of Thorn Mail. And where is Mikhail's? There it is. Go back over here. Take some Damage. Fifteen hundred to seventeen twenty five. Fifteen hundred to seventeen twenty five. Q three heal power. Let's take a look at these numbers. So twenty one seventy to twenty three eighty with no healing power from Q three is two hundred and ten for that. And Q3 healing went from 1500 to 1725 approximately, which is 225. So the difference for that is about 15, which does add up properly with, with the reading from before. Because Q1 healing is 150, and then Q1 with no heal power is 130. What if we do it on a group? So, from what I've from what I've been noticing, ten percent healing power isn't gonna do it. It seems like because there there's only four items with healing power in the game. Let, let's get that clear. 
four items with healing power in the game. Technically five, but I'm not counting Forbidden Idol. There's Ardent Sensor, Mikhail's, Redemption, and Shirelia's. Shirelia's is the most useful for Aatrox because it gives him that it has the unique active of being move speed increase, which can help him actually like, stick on targets. But, uh, did you guys know that you can use Mikhail's on yourself to get yourself out of a route and slow? And grants you slow immunity if you use it on yourself. I didn't. I mean, it doesn't work for stuns, taunt. Actually, it might work for taunts. It doesn't work for stuns, fears, silences, because you can't use items under the effect of any of those. You might be able to use it for taunts, but I'm not sure. So. What I'm thinking is that uh, Mikhail's might be situationally actually good on Aatrox. Because what I've been trying to do, I've been trying to use uh, Shirelia's and Redemption, and that's it. But I might actually be able to use Mikhail's for something. If they're if their team is like full of roots and slows. Shut up AFK warning. Also, I want to check something. There's something that gives flat man regen. Well, uh, there is not. I cannot get any bonus from the harmony effect. It makes sense, but I am sad about it. <laughs> it does make sense. So, let's uh. Let's group the enemy, some enemy dummies together. Let's group three of them together. We'll take some damage. We'll use Q3 on this group. One, what? Oh, that's about 600 HP. <coughs> I want that to be said right now. That was about 600 HP. Eight hundred to fourteen. Eight hundred to fourteen. Fourteen. Eight hundred to fourteen. It was kind of like fifteen, but we'll go with fourteen eighty. Q three healing power. Three targets. So eight hundred to fourteen eighty. That is 600 health plus. But what about without Mikhail's? What if we don't have a Mikhail's? How much is that? How much is it without Mikhail's? I, mean, I don't think my health is low enough yet. That should be good enough. 1835 to 23. Eight. Fuck. I need a new page. We'll do it again. We'll, we'll do it again. Run, run the experiments again. Eighteen seven two to twenty three nine seven seventeen. Fuck! I already lost track of the number. You know what? You know what? Better plan. Better plan. We'll plan to be around seventeen fifty, and then we'll we'll just. 
do the do the number right there, right then and there. We'll wait for the we'll wait for the health regen. Seventeen hundred to twenty two thirty. Twenty two thirty. Seventeen hundred to twenty two thirty. Approximately. Let's see, that is about 500 health, 530, compared to the about 600 health from the, from the uh, healing power one. Q3, no healing power, three target, fuck, three target. So, uh, I hope with this math you understand that healing power does in fact affect Aatrox's healing. Now, I didn't really check to see if it affected Death Dance and not Aatrox's healing. But we're not going to check for that, because you're going to be building Death Dance anyway. But, anyway, that's not the important part. The important part is that healing power does increase your healing. Now, it doesn't increase it substantially. Let's, let's not get that mixed up or anything. It is not by far an, a large increase. In healing but it could be situational and pretty much the only one you'd actually be able to build is Mikhail's like redemption would be nice you could heal your team with redemption you could damage the enemies I mean redemptions just good all around but it mm, Mm, it depends on if your support has a redemption as well or not because you don't want to stack redemptions because it, it has the effect and while it still is pretty good you're not really building enough heal and shield power to actually heal your team as much because the heal from redemption is kind of reliant on actually building heal power but because you're not building heal power from your from the rest of these items it's not actually that worth it like how much are you going to be healing let's let's take a max level target for example a max level target so level 18 and you get the heal is 20 plus 20 Fuck off AFK warning. The heal is plus 20 for every level that they have for redemption. So it'd be 18 times 20, which is a big number. Uh, let's see. Uh, there's a zero. And then there's a six. And then there's a 360. And then that's plus 10 from the base healing. So we're looking at a 370 heal just with redemption not calculating its own heal power and heal and shield power is three times as effective on redemption's heal so you know just times that three si actually, hmm, divide 370 by uh, 0.3 no that doesn't sound right We'll divide it by 30 and see what we get. Zero, one, then we do that. Seven, two, 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 two. That doesn't seem right. I'm not good at math, guys. Ah. Let's see, what, what's 10% of 370? 
37. Nope. Nope. Yes? If I were to multiply 10 and 37, would I get 370? Guys, I am struggling with this math thing. Yes, I would get 370. Okay, so 10% of 370 is 37. So, if we add three 37s on top of that 370, let, let's do the math again real quick. Uh, 21. Take a minute, you do that, and one, one. So you add that 101 on the 370, and you get a 471 heal at max level for redemption now that that'd be really nice for an ADC and maybe a, an AP assassin assassins in general that don't haven't really built their uh, a lot of health but for someone like Aatrox who's got 3,000 health usually at late game it's not that helpful that that's like a drip in a bucket drip in a, drop in a bucket whatever so Mikhail's Mikhail's would be better if their team is AP heavy lots of roots or slows uh, if, if they have someone that can stun your ADC if you want to use it on your ADC instead of yourself which if you're getting carried by your ADC I would highly recommend but I can see Mikhail's being a situational item and because it is so cheap it can actually be built like a third item or something if you need that MR now, it doesn't give health but it does give that cooldown reduction still and then the heal power, and then the active, so it's actually not that bad. So yeah. Mikhail's is a situational item. I will be testing that out more in the coming days. But for now, uh, keep in mind that Mikhail's might actually be a good item for Aatrox build sometimes.